This seems to be the end of me. I always thought I would be snapped in twain by the jaws of some slavering beast. I am Baroness Aurelia Hamelock, CEO of the Jacobs Corporation. I've just been informed that you rescued my brother. Disappointing. It's a family affair, and you've no business interfering. That said, vault hunters are nothing more than whores. So, I will simply pay you to leave my planet. Come to Jacobs Manor to negotiate your price. Ah, my rescuer in the flesh. Oh, and when you see Alistair, tell him I'm rich. Vault Hunter, you magnificent bastard! You did it! Now I am truly in your debt. Vault Hunter, my sister contacted you, didn't she? Yep, Aurelia offered to pay me to leave Eden 6. That damn harpy! Anything Aurelia offers in one hand is only to distract from the knife in the other. If you set foot in that manner, she will try to kill you. Which is why we're going. Winnie! Vault Hunter, you did right by us, prying Alistair from the fangs of those zealots. Now, Jacobs is true to his word. I'll get you that vault key, but that means both you and I are going into that harpy's den together. The key's been in my family for generations, but the exact location, well, that's one secret my father took to his grave. You accept Aurelia's invitation and keep her distracted while I search the manor for the key. Itching for a fight. My ass is itching. If you must. Meet with my sister. I shall speak plainly. Aurelia is one of the wealthiest creatures in the galaxy, but do not be fooled by the fine furs and priceless jewels she wears. She has the heart of a bandit. She takes what she wants. She believes in nothing but herself. If she had the charisma of Tyrene or the cunning of Troy, she would have started her own cult long ago. She has found her true family in the Calypsos.
reaches for the cash. I knew you'd come. A vault hunter's loyalty is always for sale. Come to the manor and you'll get your money. <laughs> down the Calypso's followers along the way. Followers, servants, all nearly as dispensable as vault hunters. devotion makes a rich bitch want a cult of her own perhaps when my business here is finished <clears throat>
inside the manor by way of a rather tight underground passage. Jacob's estate has more entrances than a harlot and a bordello for squids, if you don't mind a tight squeeze. Speaking of suckers, while you distract Aurelia, I'll search the cabaret in the theater wing. My father had a study hidden underneath the stage. If there's a clue to the vault key, it'll be in there. I'm in. It rustles my jackboots to see that harp it chilling my ancestral halls. My family's portraits were thrown out into the gully with no more pomp than a spent sheep gut. But I wouldn't give to introduce her to the business end of my shotgun. As I'm heading to the estate one day, I hear somebody shooting and cursing. So I go around the corner and find this boy Wainwright, pistol in hand, trying to shoot cans off a fence. I ain't no gunslinger, but the kid, he was a terrible shot. Squinting and licking his lips and cursing and saying he'd never be a Jacobs. Then I figure out why. Kid's blind in one eye. So I come up to him and say, hey, kid, try a shotgun. Right on time, Vault Hunter. Please do come in. That woman can make even proper hospitality sound sinister. But go along with whatever she says while I search the cabaret. I'll be with you in just a moment. Wait for me in the dining hall and we'll discuss your payment. Oh. <clears throat> So, Clayton, you wish to speak to me? Clay's fine. Old Monty just got a generous offer on the Jacobs Corporation. He turned it down, of course, but I thought you'd want to know it came from one Aurelia Hammerlock. I assure you she cares little for Jacobs itself. This is about me. Figured out that much myself. But your sister doesn't strike me as a type to let things lie. You know her, Alistair. Is this the end or the beginning? The lizard. Afraid you lost me there. Once, when we were children, my sister and I found an extremely rare lizard in the woods near our home. A magnificent specimen. Aurelia wanted to keep it as a pet, but my sister has never been one for cultivating life, shall we say. I nurtured it in secret, despite her insisting the lizard... Holy me! You should see the look on your stupid face! The vault thief! As promised. Not bad, Baroness. But you still owe us a vault key. I am working on it as we speak. Well, I will leave you to your fun. Good doing business with you, Vault Hunter. <laughs> this is awesome. We haven't really had a chance to get to know each other, huh? And Ty's been doing most of the talking. She does that, right? She's the center of the galaxy, and the rest of us just sort of orbit around her. But things are changing. Freaking look at me! I've never felt this good in my life! Whoa! What is this? What is this? Your siren friend? She didn't know what she had. With this power, I can pull the stars out of the goddamn sky. You know, Tyreen says we should let you keep playing along. Yeah, a little competition gets our followers all riled up. <laughs> but I'm not one of them. No, not anymore. And I'm done getting table scraps. Fill your hands, you zealot scum! Huh? Oh, I'ma kill you! Come and get me, you rat-faced bastard! Search the cabaret. I'll keep this punk ass rat boy running around like a jabber with his bunghole on fire.
what I do. They're getting away! Children of the vault, wipe your empty heads up and start shooting! Kill the vault hunter! Here they come!
Ray Theater is up ahead. Push through! of his favorite plays in the theater. See if one of them has the clue. I know. My father always loved Typhon de Leon and the Vault Ruins. Find the poster for that and set it up on stage. My father idolized Typhon to Leon. Find his poster and try recreating it. If I recall the story correctly, you'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins backdrop. If I recall the story correctly, you'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins backdrop. If I recall the story correctly, you'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins backdrop. If I recall the story correctly, you'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins backdrop. If I recall the story correctly, you'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins backdrop. If I recall the story correctly, 
You'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins Backdrop. If I recall the story correctly, you'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins Backdrop. If I recall the story correctly, you'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins Backdrop. the Vault Arch, and the Ruins Backdrop. If I recall the story correctly, you'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins Backdrop. If I recall the story correctly, you'll need to arrange the set with Typhon, the Vault Arch, and the Ruins Backdrop. looking for down here. I'm not entirely sure. My father said he kept all his records down there. Look for something record-like. Back to you. They couldn't have.
spoke with my sister and lived to tell the tale. Never mind the harpy. That record. May I see it, Vault Hunter? So long, Vault Hunter. Still can't believe the Calypso's murdered my father. I need to get my record player working, but you know Aurelia's gonna send all those damn zealots to find us. If we're gonna last long enough to open that vault, we'll need an army of our own. I'm talking a Jacob's Resistance. It's time to take back Eden Six, and we'll start with the town of Reliance. <laughs>